All right, so in this video, I'm going to be solving the six system of equations x plus y is equal to 8, and x times y is also equal to 8. So I'm going to label this equation 1 and this equation 2. So from equation 1, let's just get one of the values. So in this case, I'm going to get the value of x. So if x plus y equals 8, then this means that x is equal to 8 minus y. And we can label this as equation 3. So if x equals 8 minus y, then for x times y equals 8, I can plug in the value of x. So I get 8 minus y times y is equal to 8. So now from here, if I, if I distribute the y, I get 8y minus y squared is equal to 8, meaning 8y minus y squared minus 8 is equal to 0 if I subtract 8 on both sides. And now from here, I'm going to multiply both sides by negative 1. And this is so that we can make this positive. So now I get negative 8y plus y squared plus 8 is equal to 0. And now that our term that's the highest degree is positive, we can put this in the front. So I get y squared minus 8y plus 8. All, on, all I did was rearrange it. Now from here, to solve this, I'm going to use the quadratic formula, which is negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So in this case, a is 1 b is negative 8, and c is 8. So I get y equals negative of negative 8 plus or minus the square root of negative 8 squared minus 4 times 1 times 8, all over 2a, so 2 times 1. This is equal to positive 8 plus or minus the square root of 64 minus 32 over 2, which is equal to 8 plus or minus the square root of 32 over 2. So now you may think the square root of 32 is not possible, but what I am going to do is I'm going to simplify this. So the square root of 32 is the same thing as the square root of 16 times 2. And I can rewrite that as the square root of 16 times the square root of 2. The square root of 16 is 4. So I get 8 plus or minus 4 root 2 over 2. Now, I'm going to divide both, both of these terms by 2 because they're both divisible by 2. So I get x equals 4 plus or minus 2 root 2. So now I have two solutions of x. x equals 4 plus 2 root 2 and x equals 4 minus 2 root 2. So now I need to find the... Sorry, this is actually y. So I get y equals 4 plus 2 root 2, and y equals 4 minus 2, 2 root 2. So now for each of these values of y, I need to find the corresponding value of x, because the system of equations for the solution, I need both the values of x and y. So going back, we have x equals 8 minus y. So if we know that x equals 8 minus y, and y is giving us 4 plus 2 root 2, this means that x is equal to 8 minus 4 plus 2 root 2, which is equal to 8 minus 4 minus 2 root 2, which is equal to 4 minus 2 root 2. So the solution to this is 4 minus 2 root 2 comma 4 plus 2 root 2. So this is one solution. And then now another solution So I get x is equal to 8 minus 4 plus 2 root 2. So x is equal to 4 plus 2 root 2. Meaning another solution is 4 plus 2 root 2 comma 4 minus 2 root 2. So these are my two solutions to the system of equations.